Hello everyone, welcome to the first video of the Vedic Math course and the first trick that we are going to learn together is Dashmasha or the Tropic Dash method. You can also call it the dot or the bar method. So the golden rule of this method is to add from bottom to top. So let's solve some questions and then I'll tell you the benefit of this method. So um, firstly, let's solve a single digit question. So four plus seven. So remember our golden rule, always go from the bottom to top. Okay, four plus seven, which is 11. So we drop the 10 and so why I wrote this, I'll tell you. So seven plus four is basically 11. So here we drop the 10, this becomes a bar. So this is the 10 and this remaining one will be here. Now we add this next number to this number that we left over here. So one plus nine, that is 10. 10, again, we drop that 10, so bar zero. 8 plus 0 is 8, plus 4 is 12, so bar 2, right, because 10 and 12. 6 plus 2 is 8, and 8 plus 8 is 16, so bar 6. 7 plus 6 is 13, so bar 3, and 3 plus 6 is 9. So when you reach to the top, when you are at the end, and you uh, have the answer as a single digit number. Remember, very important, single digit number, you can write that answer in as the ones digit. So six plus three, which is nine. So that becomes our ones place. And for the tens place, you count the number of tens you dropped, okay? Count the number of tens we dropped, which is, one, two, three, four, five. The answer is 59. Done. Now the benefit of this trick is that uh, when we are doing it traditionally, we have to keep uh, 11 in our mind. So for example, when we go from six plus seven, okay, 13, we have to keep 13 in our mind, plus eight, okay. Then we have to ca keep calculating it. And if we make a small error, the answer is going to be wrong. So instead of remember every remembering everything, we are doing the same thing, but we are dropping the 10. And then we are getting the same answer eventually. Let's solve a two digit question. So six plus three, which is nine. So whenever it's a single digit answer, we don't drop a 10, right? Because we don't have a 10. So six plus three is nine, plus two is 11. So bar one. Then four plus one is five, plus nine is 14, so bar four. Next, 4 plus 7 is 11. So we write bar 1. Bar 1. 4 plus 1 is 5. Plus 6 is 11. So bar 1 again. And 8 plus 1 is 9. So we write 9 as it is a single digit number. And for this one, we don't write our number of bars in the tens place. Now, remember this step, it's very important. So we count the number of bars again, that is one, two, three, four, and we carry it over to the tens place because our calculation isn't over. When it was a single digit question, sure, you could write the number of bars as the tens place. But in this one, because we already have a tens place, we have to carry it over. So now for the tens place, we'll do the same thing. We have to drop the tens and calculate it. So uh, four plus three is seven, plus one eight, plus six is bar four, which is 14. Then eight plus four is bar 12, bar two, which is 12. Seven plus two is nine, plus four is 13, so bar three. Three plus three is nine, and plus two is 11. 
bar 1 and don't remember the carryover 1 plus 4 is 5 so because it's a single digit we can just write it down and now for, what what about the bars we can we cannot just leave them so we count the number of bars here 1 2 3 4 and we write it as a hundreds digit the answer is 459 isn't it simple now uh, let's go with this another two digit question now instead of uh, elaborating the method we'll try to go a little bit faster so 8 plus 5 is bar 3 which is 13 5 plus 3 8 plus 8 is 16 bar 6 6 plus 4 is 10 bar 0 always remember 10 bar 0 not only bar but bar 0 okay 9 uh, 0 plus 9 is 9 plus 5 is bar 4 4 plus 8 is bar 12 and 2 plus 4 is 6 so that's our ones place now we'll count the number of bars which is 1 2 3 4 5 and we carry it over to the hundreds place now 9 plus 3 is 12 bar 2 2 plus 2 is 4 plus 7 bar 1 which is 11 3 plus 1 is 4, plus 7 is bar 1, 11, 6 plus 1 is 7, plus 2 is 9, plus 5 is 14. So bar 4, 4, and I think this, the carryover got erased. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, this is 5. So 4 plus 5 is 9, 9 is our tens place. And the number of bars, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, is our hundreds place. 496 is our answer. Next one, 5 plus 2 is 7, plus 1 is 8, plus 6 is bar 4, which is 14, 4 plus 9 is bar 3, 7 plus 3 is bar 0, which is 10, 8 plus 4 is bar 2, which is 12, and 5 plus 2 is 7. So that's our ones place. One, two, three, four, number of bars. It gets carried over. Two plus one is three, plus one is four, plus six is bar zero. Zero plus nine is nine, plus seven is bar six. Six plus eight is fourteen, bar four. Four plus four is eight, plus five is bar three, three plus three is nine. So that's our tens place. And the number of bars, which is one, two, three, four, four ninety seven is the answer. Nine plus eight. Now this is a three digit answer. We'll follow the same same trick and it's going to be really simple so 8 9 plus 8 is 17 bar 7 7 plus 6 bar 3 13 9 plus 3 is 12 bar 2 5 plus 2 is 7 plus 5 is bar 2 4 plus 2 is 6 plus 5 is bar 1 1 bar 1, 1 plus 1 is 2, so that's our 1's place. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, as usual, it gets carried over. Now let me use a different color, yes. So 4 plus 1 is 5, plus 1 is 6, plus 4 is bar 6. So 4 plus 1, 5. Six plus eight is bar six.
but it's not right. I made a mistake here. <laughs> so again, eight plus nine is bar seven. 7 plus 6 is bar 3, 3 plus 9 is bar 2, 5 plus 2 is 7, plus 5 is bar 2, 2 plus 4 is 6, plus 5 is bar 1, and 1 plus 1 is 2. Now, the number of bars, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, gets carried over, right? So, oops. Five. So 4 plus 1 is 5, plus 1 is 6, plus 8 is 14. 4 plus 4 is 8, plus 2 is bar 0, which is 10. And then 8 plus 4 is bar 2, which is 12. And then 9 plus 2 is 11. So bar 1. And then 5 plus 1 is 6. So that's for our tens place. And uh, the number of bars gets carried over. Remember? Because there are more hundreds digit, we can not just write the number of bars. We have to carry it over. So the number of bars, which is 1, 2, 3, 4 gets carried over so 8 plus 3 is bar 1 3 plus 1 is 4 plus 7 is bar 1 6 plus 1 is 7 plus 1 is 8 plus 6 bar 4 4 plus 4 is 8, plus 6 is bar 4 again, 4 plus 4 is 8, and now, what about the bars? So we count the number of bars, 1, 2, 3, 4, and we tried it. So 4, 8, 6, 2 is our answer. Now, I'll let you try these questions. You can pause the video and take time to solve these questions. Okay, now these are some more practice questions. You can practice it at home. I will solve one question over here and the rest you can do it uh, in a piece of paper or in your notebook. So five plus one is six, plus zero is again six, plus four is 10, so bar zero, eight plus zero is eight, plus two is again bar zero, and 6 gets carried down, 2 is the carryover, 2 plus 6 is 8, plus 1 is 9, plus 4 is bar 14, 9 plus 4 is bar 3, 3 plus 3 is 9, plus 7 is 16. Or bar 6 and 6 plus 2 is 8 number of bars get carried over so 1 2 3 and this gets carried over yes 7 plus 3 is again bar 0 0 plus 2 is 2 plus 6 is 8 plus 0 is 8 plus 4 is 12, 8 plus 2 is again 10 bar 0, and 3 comes down, number of bars get carried over, so 1, 2, 3, 4, they get carried over, yes. 4 is the carryover, 
8 plus 4 is 12 bar 2 Uh, 3 plus 2 is 5 plus 7 is 12 2 plus 1 is 3 plus 5 is 8 plus 9 is 17 so bar 7 and 7 plus 4 is 11 remember now this is a two digit answer at the end so now here you have to write a bar above the carryover and write bar 1 so as usual we follow our steps so this one comes down as the thousands place and the number of bars which we left is going to be the ten thousands place so one two three and four so four three eight six is our final answer this may seem hard right now, but uh, because we were going to slow, it will be uh, hard for some time. But when you keep practicing, you will get faster and you'll get the results. Uh, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you have a great day ahead and stay tuned for more videos.